Hello there from Colour Passion Studio. We have the dynamic duo, which is Jackie Yates and Kim Gow, the co-founders of Colour Passion. And we want to show you about the, the two different whites that we use. So um, today we're going to be using the Passion Base Cell White, and we're going to be using three different colors. We're going to be using the Magenta, which is absolutely gorgeous. We're gonna be using the Aubergine, which is amazing. And we're going to be using the mint. Now these are all our pastes, our color pastes. And with, the, uh, with these, they're a lovely fluid consistency. And I always give them a stir first. You won't need a lot of the color. These are concentrated, guys. But um, give it a stir because if it's been sitting for a while, uh, it's, it's gonna be a little bit of a challenge. See that, okay? Yep. Awesome. All right, so now we're just going to be popping I really just dipped the stick in and now I'm stirring to make sure that it mixes up and it's lovely and opaque. That is what you're looking for. If it's too uh, transparent, you need to add a little bit more. But that's looking pretty good to me. What do you think, Jax? Absolutely amazing. Beautiful. It's beautiful and creamy. Yep, lovely. Okie dokie. So the next one we're going to use or add is one, one of my personal favorites it's gorgeous the mint that is gorgeous just and this is beautiful in seascapes by the way everyone yes. so i'm just going to pop again just a little bit just wiping off all the excess because we don't otherwise we're just wasting it it's very uh, highly pigmented and concentrated yeah a little bit goes a long way. It does. And by the way, on that point, with our jars, when we first got them, because we love the jars and the concept and everything, we actually, they're all 60 mil and we put um, 50 grams in them by weight. So that's why sometimes they appear, you know, like only half full. They've definitely got the correct amount of weight. But what we have managed to do is find a, finally, a 50 mil. So we'll uh, bring those out very soon and it'll look like, you know, you're getting value for money. That is that gorgeous color. It's quite hot here today, so we need to work fairly quickly because as you probably realize, the hotter the temperature, the quicker they go off. So. Oh, wow, that looks amazing. Oh, I love this. Cerise and Magenta are oh, my favorite. Absolutely divine color. So that is the Magenta. I find the magenta works so well with the purple passion as well. Yeah, as well. So yeah. We use it with the aubergine, yep. but the purple passion is oh, it's amazing with it. Yeah, it's nice to have colours so you can not all samey samey, so you can get a bit of depth. Yeah, you want the contrast. You do, you do. And aubergine, and this will give it a bit of contrast. This is a slightly thicker one, as you can see. We have asked our suppliers to basically send them all a little bit more liquid, makes it a bit easier. But um, this is, and I've used this a lot, and it's a gorgeous, gorgeous color. But you, again, you don't need a lot. And these dark ones are just incredible. Give it a good mix. Okay. So, what we're going to do now, as it's a base white, it's, well, it's base, isn't it? So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to pour it over here. You don't necessarily have to pour it all over either. Just in bits is fine. I don't tend to cover it all, but you could if you wanted to. Okay. Um, so the secret of this is to put, obviously, the white down first, but your colours on the top. Thanks. Colours on the top of the white to get wonderful, wonderful results. So I'm going to pour this straight over the top. 
Oh. Doesn't matter if a bit runs off. Of course, we didn't take this, but that doesn't matter because we're only doing this for a demo for you. And then this gorgeous magenta. Should have called it magnificent magenta because it is. It is stunning. Um, yeah. And this amazing mint. Those three colours. Wow. Gorgeous. Okay. You see it's selling without any doing anything. That's right, we haven't even done anything yet. It's starting to sell. That's all right. So now what we're going to do is I'm just going to hit it with a propane torch. And all this is doing is like breaking those bubbles on the surface. And it just helps a little bit as well. This is obviously not level because it's running this the other way. Hopefully it's all right. It should be all right. Okay. Right, so now what we're going to do is we're going to swipe. So I'm just touching it ever so lightly. And pushing it off. I don't know if that had white under that or not. All right, we'll do that. And now what we're going to do is just heat it. And hopefully we're going to see all these wonderful cells just pop up. And you can see them all starting to pop up. And these will continue, by the way, to evolve a little. The advantage with our pigments as well, even the colours sell on their own mm. without the enhancement of the white as well. That's true. That's true. I mean, this was a very fast and quick demo just to show you. But you can see they're very um, nice little cells as opposed to lacing that you get with the top cells. And we're going to do that in the next little video. Um, probably could have added maybe a little bit more white, but um, I'm used to seeing like quite a lot of big cells. But um, um, as I say, with this one here, it's not an issue. You get the idea of how um, the base white is used. And you can see some beautiful little cells here popped up and some lovely ones here. And then you can just see like normal sort of lacing happening here and more, more white popping up what there. What I can do is I can take the camera down and look a little bit closer. That's a good idea. Cells. Yeah. I love how they keep evolving. They keep Look at those. Gorgeous. Amazing. Yeah, they're just and that was with limited. Limited. Heat. Limited everything actually. Yeah, we didn't absolutely. we haven't done much at all with this. That's just doing it by itself. Yep. Wow. Beautiful. Okay, so hopefully, look, it's very basic, but hopefully this has given you a bit of an idea on um, just how to use that base white. Uh, we will do some more, but at least we just wanted to give you a quick overview of it. Okay, thanks. Have a great day. And uh, I won't say, well, yes, I will say a very Merry Christmas. But of course, you might be watching this and it's the new year. So Happy New Year. Bye. Bye.